this short string king video um bit of background noise in this one because i've got to keep the windows open for ventilation so what the hell is going on here okay uh on dan Erlwine's channel uh his stumac channel which is great for picking up tips on uh how to do things with guitars um he had this tip which was uh if you get an old um an old piece of uh a guitar like a bridge that's all chewed up and dirty and uh, you need to clean it up it can be quite tricky to get into all the nooks and crannies and get all the dirt out but this uh, friend of his from Brazil had this uh, idea of using a uh, an old um, basically an old uh, power unit for I think it was a radio or something like that and you wire this up and put it in a salt solution and stick your uh, the thing you want to get cleaned into it and uh, and the dirt just suddenly starts to uh, bubble off it it's incredible so I'm not using a guitar pot I got this old uh, chisel um, off eBay a really nice old chisel but the handle had to be changed anyway and I thought what the hell I'll uh, I'll use this technique to see if I can try it out and get it to work so that's been going for about 10 minutes and you can see the stuff coming off um, a lot of dirt's coming off. Um, they reckon it takes about two hours, so we'll come back a little bit later on. Okay, so this has now been going for about 40 minutes. Um, as you can see, it's absolutely filthy. I'm going to carry on leaving this for another hour or maybe two hours, uh, and we'll see how much dirt's come off. Okay, so um, things moved on a bit since the last video. Um, I finished doing this chisel. Um, which cleaned up really nicely. There was a lot of rust on it. I've since sharpened it and lapped the back of it, but nevertheless, you can see uh, it's pretty clean. And I also did a uh, bridge, um, which is an old uh, Korean bridge that I had, and it was a bit dirty. Uh, and as you can see, it is now super shiny clean. So what I'm going to do next is take this bridge which um, I'm not sure if the camera's going to pick this up but there's a fair amount of dirt inside down inside um, around and about it uh, and I'm going to put this bridge into the electrolysis system and see how clean that one gets so you've got a before and after but um, all this dirt and stuff it's, it's kind of green and brown and orangey stuff came off the chisel it's just like an incredible amount of stuff that came off As you can see how dirty it was but it does show you how effective this is so this is the way i'm going to clean stuff from now on but uh i'm going to put the the bridge in now and i'll show you what it looks like afterwards just to show you what it looks like when it's working <clears throat> you can't actually see the bridge because there's so much dirt in this salt solution now that uh, it's not visible but there it is bubbling away and what's happening is that the uh, current passing from here over to the hammer is dragging all the dirt and muck off the metal bridge so let's see what it looks like when it's finished. Right, I'm going to take the uh, pickup out now. We'll see how clean it is. Uh, wow. That's great. Really clean. Um, it's got everything out, all the stuff that's down in the screws and inside the saddles. Everything's come off. That's fantastic. Well, this is a great method for for cleaning metal. And uh, you bring your guitar to me and you've got a rusty old piece of metal on your guitar. This is probably the way I'm going to clean it. Thanks very much.